Hello. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> oh, I'm never doing that again. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Bodies. Today, it's going to be my first video on Ernest Gabe. So my day, I think I'm just going to show you how to kill Warcats. Now I am using probably the best gear to bring. But you do need a Salvii. Elite Void. I mean, you can do with Armadillo. You know, bless the hide or whatever, but you want to leave void. Now you do want the Ruby Dragon Bolt E, and I do have the Diamond Bolts as well. Usually, I just bring extended anti fire, regular ranging, anti venom, three prayers, stuff like this. I have this, so I can use my teleport house. So I show you. <clears throat> I do that. You know, I drink the pool. Then I come over here. This is how to get here. Or at least the quickest way, I believe. Yeah, I use the bank if I need to get re-geared or whatever. And then talk to this guy, since you don't have the seal passage thing. You're going to get kicked off. And then you're boom, you're right here. And if you ever die, you know, you collect from that guy with 100k. I didn't get that. Oh. Phone act, no. Alright, but anyways, <clears throat> now I have the Slayer Staff, so for the undead thing, for the little baby blue dragon it throws at me, so that's why I have Laws, Death, or Dust, and Chaos. Now I'm not the best at this, right? but I mean I've gotten, I think, 300 kills. And now if you're using this setup, with the dragon fire war shield you want to do range and rigor or range and um, eagle eye so you know you want to drink that drink this set it up now you do want to mark these tiles if you're using the crossbow like me just so it's a little easier and all you do is just sit back and relax now this is the venom thing you just click that or you know drink it from there now those big fireballs you do want to move out of the way or you're pretty much going to die one shot. All you have to do is move two aisles away. Now this is the little things where you can't touch anymore. So I still screw up on this. You know you just want to eat, turn off your prayer maybe. Now you can also hit them while doing it, like I'll show you this. But sometimes you do take damage if you're just not quick enough. And then you just want to come back. Do the same thing over and over again. Now once he's like maybe 340 or something. Now that's the prayer where it shuts off your prayer. So you want to get that back up. But when it gets down to like 340 or so. Um, you want to switch to diamond bolts. Now that's the thing where you have to get your thing out. Your slayer staff quick. And just hit him. Boom just like that. Get your crossbow out. Prayer up. Hit him again. That attacks just, I don't know, it's regular. That's the range attack. That's also a magic attack. Yep, same one. Now I'm pretty much there. That's the big fireball. <clears throat> it's pretty simple. You just have to look. Now the green little fire, or the spit thingies. Swap back and forth. Drink your prayer pie, whatever. You know, and then whenever, you know, you could always just do this all the time. But if you mess up once or twice, you might die. So I don't usually do that. But it does speed up the kills if you actually do hit. And that's pretty much it. Now, of course, if you're using this with this full gear, you might, you're probably going to get like three to four kills a trip. Unless you keep getting hit by those, uh... The green spit on the ground, whatever it's called. But then other than that, you know, you should be fine. Three to four kills a trip. And that is how you kill Warcast. Like and subscribe as my you know, this is my first video. I'm trying to get up there. But I'll see you guys later.